He's talking to you. Dad has had an amazing All season. Way. He's got to find out what exactly happened with the letter. He took a big step, moved down for a bit. That's right. Where's Dad going at this point? Where's Dad going at this point? Yeah, what's Kevin up to? Okay. Well, I think if you watched the last episode, you see that Kevin is slowly uh, inching his way back into the Hamilton household. No pun intended. Um, and uh, I think we'll have to watch the next couple of weeks and see where it goes from there. But uh, it seems like Kevin and Lacey are making amends, at least on a physical level. Whether or not he's going to forgive her for that kind of sadistic move that she pulled with the letters, that remains to be seen. We'll see. You know, as we discovered last episode, he's got some skeletons in his closet as well. And he's not always he's not always been the good guy that you know everybody's perceived him as as, as being over seasons one and two. You know, he was uh, an absentee father and so forth. So he's got some sins to atone for as well. So maybe that means that he will more readily forgive Lacey for her. How has that been for you as an actor portray somebody suddenly out of the blue? You're like, oh wait, what's that? This squeaky clean guy. Yeah, that's very strange, and it uh, it's very exciting because it adds a, to a, a, a new dimension to your character, and you have to go back and kind of adjust your backstory. So it just uh, it makes the whole job much more exciting, and much more rich. So I'm happy to throw as many curveballs my way as you can, and that makes the job keep you know more and more fun. Yeah. Well, even despite whatever flaws he may have had in his history, he still seems like a really strong backbone of the family, and he's going to kind of take on. Whatever that burden may include, whether it be the friction between the relationship between the mother and daughter, or uh, holding his wife accountable for his actions. Right. Yeah, that's true. But something was interesting uh, when we shot the uh, episode number. Uh, 210, where he has the conversation with Jenna at the kitchen table and kind of tells her that he wasn't always there, and how much guilt this man must have felt over the course of the years, sort of being the favorite of his daughter, really knowing that he learned all of his parenting skills and kind of uh, parenting prowess from Lacey, whereas Lacey was sort of the unsung hero, and he was getting all of the accolades, he must have felt really, really guilty about that, so hopefully some of that came out. So now that all the kind of drama, family drama is played out, are we going to be seeing some more of the comedy between the mom and the dad? Well, is it played out? That we don't really know. There could be some more drama headed our way. Um, I can tell that there are some some very comedic moments coming in episode 211. Uh, the finale, I don't quite recall how comedic mom and dad are. Um, but hopefully with season three, we're going to get to explore the dynamic of the Hamilton house a little more than we got to see even in season two, which was a fair amount. Because I think it's one of the more interesting and sort of influential, uh, you know, on, on, a, on a teen's life, you know, the parent dynamic is such a massive influence, so I hope we get a chance to see a little bit more of it. in a lot of ways. Yeah. Yeah. Well, thank you for your time tonight. Hey, thanks again. Yeah.